Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So about two years ago, I posted a video on how you can edit the metadata of an image or photo on Windows 10 and Windows 11. And I'll leave that video linked down below and in the end screen if you'd like some more information. Now, the reason I'm mentioning that video is because right at the tail end of that video, I briefly touched on how you can actually remove the location data on Windows from a screenshot or a photo. And I thought just to do this quick video, um, if you are concerned about privacy, because as you may well know, when you take a photo, the, the data with details about the image, including things like your camera that took it, your exposure levels, the color information, is all in that image. And most cell phones and tablets these days, smartphones, also by default now include the location the photo was taken. So if you are concerned about privacy, and obviously if you're sharing photos online, um, and you don't want anybody to know your location or your, your just details pertaining to um, your own personal privacy, then just to show you how you can actually remove the um, data um, if you are trying to... Um, edit that metadata on a Windows device. So to do this, we just head to just a random photo that's been taken. And if we right click on that, and we click on properties, and this pertains to both Windows 10 and Windows 11, by the way. And we head to the details tab. Yeah, right at the bottom, it says remove properties and personal information. So that's what I'm referring to. Click on that. And now you'll see, if you check the toggle, remove the following properties from this file. You can um, remove each individual one, or you can check the box to uh, the data that you want to remove. Or if you really want um, a photo to be private, you can just select all. And then if you want to have a copy, you can create a copy with all possible properties removed. So you don't have to actually remove that from your original photo. You can still keep your original photo. Or if you want, you know, you're not concerned about your original, you can remove the following properties from this file, which will be the original. But just as an example, I'm going to create a copy with all possible properties removed. And I've selected all. And then you just click OK. OK. And you'll see now, if I head back, there's a copy now created of that photo with that relevant metadata removed. So just wanted to get it out there, and especially if you are sharing a lot of photos online, because anybody can download that photo and can check out the location it was taken and um, some extra little information maybe you don't want to um, be seen online. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.